Hey guys, how are you today? Well, um, here I am to just help you understand uh, the overall dynamics of you know how the project management softwares are. I mean, which are the best ones available uh, in 2020? Um, as of 6th of February 2020, I have collected some prices and you know tried to compare it so you know you get an idea what's actually happening. Um, project management it doesn't need to be only for the conventional project managers you know these tools can be useful if you are a student if you are a, a decision maker in your family or maybe um, in your relatives you have certain things you want to collaborate on or if you are a freelancer you know you just name it there are so many uh, different ways if you are just going to work in a team um, and you will be managing the data managing the you know you'll have certain level of uh, planning that you want to do proper planning collaborate on the planning get the approval and you know make decisions and you know kind of a workflow you can you know you can think of so project management work management task management whatever you call it but you know let's say so uh, these are the best softwares according to uh, you know whoever has reviewed this um william fenton so you know he, and and jill duffy so well you know they figured out that these are the best project management tools available in 2020 you can do your own google research by the way you'll find similar softwares you know repeating again and again you know, most of the research so you know what i have done i have taken each of these and compared uh, with in terms of especially in terms of prices you know feature wise you can go into more details and you know try and find out you know what, what you like and what you don't like they generally have more or less similar features for what you can do through them and uh, you know if, if certain softwares uh, if they don't have uh, you know some features not available today hopefully you know, it should be available very soon so you know feature wise more or less unless if you are looking very specific thing that's only available in one place um, that's one criteria you have to you know find out from the prices point of view go further from there and then compare the features like by like and you know see which one is best for you but let's have a quick look currently in this particular video you know the focus is on pricing point that's let's have a look so we'll go like step by step from zoho to uh, easy red mine so let's continue well zoho look at this pricing here so you're looking at $1,581 per year for 20 users. Don't worry about this pricing. You know, I have put together these prices to compare per 10 users. So uh, as you can see, Zoho has minimum 15 users. So minimum 15 users. So I have compared this express plan because 15 users, that's where, you know, I'm just not looking at the features too deep right now. Uh, but then you can, if you, for 10 users, these are the sufficient features that Zoho thinks. Well, if you think, uh, you know, you need more features, then you can look at further. But then you're looking for, you know, price increase for sure. So uh, let's not to worry too much about the actual annual prices, which I will take you through this table very quickly. You know, once we go through, once we go through these different softwares, at least you get an idea, you know, what price range you're looking at. Zoho, somewhere around 744 Australian dollars per year. So I have converted that into US dollars in this Excel file. So just you know keep that thing in mind. Second one, liquid planner. So you're looking at $45 per month per user. So you can think of that you know higher price range. You're actually looking at 5400 US dollars per 10 users. Liquid planner, very expensive, probably one of the most expensive in this batch looking at the teamwork teamwork you have this you know per five user premium plan uh, you have fifteen dollars per month so that fifteen dollars per month that's eighteen hundred dollars annually for ten users so you know they have for five users and of course you can go for ten users and that price will double so by the way this is fifteen dollars per month per user minimum you can get five users so of course you know the, the calculations i have done is for 10 users then the smart sheet so smart sheet well they have individual and business plans which one i have compared business plan so 10 users why is that because this one is individual that's why you know of course you're not going to get um, unless if you have like 10 individuals using this like 14 dollars per month that they're, they're paying they're not going to get all these team features because you know this in individual plans so for business 
plan uh, which is basically for teams uh, if you go for like 10 users uh, 25 multiplied by 10 multiplied by 12 months uh, that comes to you know smart sheet comes to three thousand dollars that's probably second highest in this batch so you know smart sheet then you have this Gantt Pro. Now, if you if you are from project management, you know that this Gantt charts are basically when you put together your schedule in your project management, uh, project management, program management, portfolio management. If you put together your Gantt chart, um, you put together your schedule. That schedule will have its own corresponding Gantt chart, which will give you a timeline view of tasks um, over the period of time with the interdependencies. So you know that's the Gantt chart. So this particular software or tool is specializing only in Gantt charts so you know it doesn't it's not going to give you all the other features that you can have outside this Gantt you know feature of this particular Gantt chart feature of this particular tool so you know, just keep that thing in mind so if you go for the team plan for 10 users six dollars ninety per user per month it actually comes to 828 but then it's only limited in features I mean it's very specific for time view of the tasks that's if you're only looking for that then well you know this is one candidate for you so that's Gantt Pro now other one is the Reich uh, Reich uh, you know, has if you go for professional they have uh, you know 10 users so you got nine dollars eighty cents uh, per user per month that actually comes to Reich comes to 1176 US dollars for 10 users professional plan if you go for if you go for Seluxis well if you they have this on premises plan as well but don't get caught up in this <laughs> uh, you think it's okay 450 and then I don't have to pay for like for any anything for future it's just one off price but then you look at this if you go for maintenance contract well you will be paying for maintenance contract plus if you put the software somewhere on your server you will be paying you know if you put it on a virtual uh, private server so VPS then you will be paying probably thirty dollars or forty dollars a month at least um, and then all the maintenance and admin fees and you know, administrative like system admin fees and all that um, that will go very high um, plus the future upgrades will only be included if you go for the maintenance contract so you will be paying the maintenance contract price um, if you don't do that well that's it that's the software you're locked in you are not going to be able to upgrade that going forward so just keep that thing in mind as well uh, but if you go for the cloud one if you go for two years payment uh, that's 21.25 dollars per user per month and if you look at that Seluxis that's 2550 dollars so that's the third highest so far in this batch Seluxis let's look at the proof hub proof hub is, is interesting so you have like $89 per month if you pay annually per month and that's it unlimited users unlimited users no per user fee no contracts of course you know because just you you can cancel anytime but you know once you are in you probably won't cancel because you have invested so much into it and so much data that has gone into it probably proof of won't have you know this data migrations also back and forth in other tools so you are stuck in it you have to do manual data entry if you move somewhere else keep that thing in mind as well so 89 dollars month per month unlimited users let's have a look proof hub unlimited control unlimited users while well, you're paying 1068 US dollars every year if their price changes from the second year third year fourth year of course you know you'll be paying the higher price but this is per year let's look at the team Gantt team Gantt is basically more about the Gantt charts uh, if you use Trello or some other tools uh, you probably must have seen team Gantt as a as a plugin there which gives you the facility of this Gantt chart so you know just keep that thing in mind if you go for the standard plan um, and you know if you go for 10 users of course you're paying $79 a month and that will that will be $948 US dollars a year well that's only for the you know Gantt chart kind of feature if you look at the easy red wine well they have again server and cloud but then with server you know what I mean if you want to go with, with server you will have to have your server cost and maintenance costs and contracts with them and the upgrade 
uh, for, to claim the upgrades you will have to pay extra you know for the uh, contract uh, payment and all that to the uh, these guys but if you go for the small team the good thing is that they have 25 users so you know small team uh, up to 25 users you are actually paying 78 dollars a month for 25 users that's it not per user for 25 users so not too bad that way but you know it's let's have a look let's have a look what happens to annual price so easy red mine small team 25 users 936 you know not too high comparing like 25 users but then you'll be paying this annually every year and prices are subject to change so keep that thing in mind as well so these were the first batch of uh, you know batch of softwares from this you know this this particular web link that I found is they have this comparison all different kind of comparison as well done here as well so you can have a look here but then I found I thought well what happened to Trello and Asana and you know Basecamp and all those things are not mentioned here how about that so I did another search and found another link where these all the good tools are actually also mentioned here so the best project management software for 2020 um, and these are the six that they mentioned well the sixth one doesn't count because the Evernote is actually uh, it's more or less a note-taking tool but let's go through this one to five so Asana this is Asana so if you if you go with the premium price eleven point ninety nine dollars if you pay annually per user per month that comes to Asana premium 10 users comes to fourteen hundred and thirty eight dollars and eighty cents US dollars every year again price is subject to change if you go to Trello if you go to business class 9.99 that's roughly ten dollars per month per user if you pay it annually and that comes to Trello it comes to one thousand one hundred and ninety eight dollars and eighty cents US dollars so you know per for ten users that's Trello if you go with Podio, which is from Citrix, if you if you go with Podio, um, if you go with uh, let's say Plus Plan uh, to claim some features and basics, even if you go with this, that's still going to be a little higher. But you know, if you just go with the Plus, uh, let's see if I have done comparison for the Plus Podio. Yeah, for Plus, ten users, you are actually looking at thirteen hundred and forty-four US dollars. So you know, that's Podio. If you look at the base camp it's uh, you know again little interesting pricing strategy that they have so the base camp business is like $99 per month flat fee um, something similar to what we had for proof hub that's right proof hub so they have something similar but there's also interesting thing so they if you pay $99 per month eternally uh, of course you know you will keep having this base camp for unlimited users that's it you don't have to unlimited users you don't have to pay per user so that's a little bit interesting here but if you only want to create three projects and within 20 users so that's actually less than you know t that's 10 users is basically less than 20 users so you know that this one qualifies the only problem is that you have three projects and you only get storage of one gigabyte so that's nowadays you know it's not too much uh, you can have a couple of documents and uh, you know you can you can probably fill up the space but if we look at here the base camp if you go with business plan unlimited you are paying every year 1188 US dollars but if you go for personal if you're individual just go with this and see you know if you like that uh, you know the features and everything try it out uh, 20 users you can still have 20 users you can collaborate with each other and it's actually free it's interesting it's actually free you can have three projects one gigabyte storage so keep that thing in mind Evernote as I said is actually note taking tool even the site their website says it's note taking tool but if you go with premium you can have 10 users you're you'll be paying eleven hundred and ninety eight dollars and eighty cents US dollars again um, there's one thing which is not in that list here which is Microsoft and I thought well you know it should be there uh, you know Microsoft the latest one that they have cloud version which is the having the you know, more fe uh, features and uh, more they have this all the other Microsoft tools they can connect with each other which is called Microsoft project portfolio project management so PPM uh, so we're gonna have a look at that as well so let's have a look 
so it's not so see these are the ones that we have looked at now let's also have a look at the microsoft there are three plants with different features as you can see um, if you just go with the basic one then thirteen dollars and seventy cents but this is then australian dollars so i have converted that into today's date uh, us dollars and that comes to still in us dollars also also it comes to for 10 users it comes to for plan one it comes to eleven hundred and eleven dollars twenty cents us dollars again uh, so you know plan one now these are different softwares and look at this there is nothing lifetime there is no lifetime plans available for a reason of course you know because they don't want to get locked into this lifetime thing um so they of course they uh, that concept is actually gone it's now everything is more or less like software as a service so their server you, they don't want <laughs> you to use your computer of course you use your computer just as a client application but then all the processing happens in their server so that's what they say well you know software as a service um and all the upgrades and everything is all included you just you know keep paying month by month and for them it's a sustaining business model <laughs> uh so maybe that's why but software as a service every, everything here now i'm going to introduce you to this infinity tool that i found i have gone to the highest plan because you know i loved it and just amazing it just changed completely changed the way i work and i'm a big fan so that's why i'm putting a little effort otherwise i generally you must have seen that i generally don't put any videos but this is infinity now you know if you go with, i highly recommend that you go with this link so you know this is my name jitesh Kuzwami. so you know it will also give you little brownie points that way for you it, it doesn't change anything of course you get uh, this affiliation so you know with, through the affiliation you know you also get better support but other than that you still get the same deal if you use this link it will help me it if you know if, if you think this tool is good it helps you it's good price it helps you it also helps infinity so in the end like it's win 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 everybody wins now have a look infinity just have a look they're also focusing on flexibility it's all about flexibility for them you know, subscribe for this for this tool for 30 days is free anyway um, you will find it's just amazing the way you think you want to structure your data you can structure it that way whether it's like product roadmap whether it's uh, you know meeting calendars whether it's the uh, content calendars whether the project management whether you have sales pipelines you have agile sprints so these are you know those uh, Trello type boards marketing campaigns so and stuff like that you have all these different applications you can go through this you know create your own CRM and things like that marketing operations project management and you know, sales you know you name it anything like if, if you are in university uh, you know if you have some kind of a, a project in your house you're just doing something renovation or whatever you can use it whatever the way you want and then you know they have this this whole application structure is like very fluid all the way through all the way through once you will use it you will know what i mean um, and that's what actually blew me as well workspaces will have unlimited boards will have unlimited folders um, have you ever seen unlimited folders will have their own unlimited subfolders and subfolders can keep going down and down and down and down you want to structure the way you want you can structure it the, that same way like if you have university within university you have different departments within different departments you have different streams within different streams you have different uh, you know uh, social communities within social communities you have different student groups within i mean you can go on and on and you can do this with infinity you cannot do that with any of the other tools that we have looked at at least i don't know uh, and then within the subfolders you will have tabs now these tabs are basically the represent the data so this these tabs are basically what you see here this is a tab what you see here so this is a tab so all these different are these are, these are different tabs and each tab can have one way of representing data so you can have this one is a table view there was another this one is a um, a column view of course is a column view so data is grouped in certain grouping labels you can again very flexible it doesn't need to be just to do doing done no no you can do it the way you like it's just amazing so you know different views you also have gantt chart view you also have the calendar view you also have form view they're also going to add more views also uh, so you know in coming times so i'm just looking forward to this other upcoming you know views as well just incredible the way you same data you can represent without any additional effort you don't have to do anything just create the view that's it you have it there you can have multiple views of the same type 
so you can collaborate uh, chat and you know invite and you know kind of uh, all the activity logs and everything notifications and everything is all included uh, you know they have they have some plans they also have this if there's an if, if this and that uh, coming which is what I'm interested in they also have some other things also coming soon now they also have done this little comparison the way that we have done comparison look at this they have also done comparison for 10 user team Trello you're looking at $1,200 per year Asana you're looking at $3,000 a year but then they must have compared higher plan Monday uh, that's another tool $1,900 a, a year click up $1,000 a year Airtable $2,400 a year per year that's right and look at this look at this $99 for lifetime for lifetime one workspace by the way one workspace is like one company you can have as many projects within that workspace as many projects as you like if you have three space workspaces like one for your personal thing one for your you know for your for your con company or one for your some other whatever that you you would like to create the workspace for forever these plans are forever so very limited time you know this will be gone in a couple of weeks as i know um and once this is gone you will never see this plan coming back again so you know have a look now if you just go for this 99 dollars plan for example you're not losing anything you know you have 10 collaborators if you're just focusing on 10 users if you have 25 users i mean this is monthly price for some of those tools that we have looked at monthly price for you know a couple of users we are looking at 25 users and this is for lifetime forever 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 if you want to go for infinite number of users i mean look at this excel file you have two tools unlimited users basecamp unlimited users proof hub you will be paying every year more than thousand dollars more than thousand dollars every year and with infinity you just pay 899 dollars that's it you have infinite users forever plus you have five terabytes worth of storage and 30 workspaces 30 workspaces as like you work in 30 different streams like 30 different companies or things like that which will have its own each workspace will have its own unlimited boards and each board will have its unlimited folders and unlimited tabs that you can create it's just amazing okay so uh, you know this is very limited offer from infinity so i thought maybe this is something definitely uh, you know people should know a lot of people they don't know about infinity but i think it's just great you know once you will start working on infinity you will be like wow this is great you know how did i not know about this before uh, so you know spread the word spread the word but if you can use this particular link it will help me i have also put this in here so you know if you just use this link it will actually help me as well so you know helps you help me help infinity so you know have a look nothing wrong in checking they have 30 days trial you know you're not losing anything but you will be blown away by the flexibility that's the primary thing the flexibility it's like you think and you can just create that uh, beautiful those beautiful things by the way uh, the one thing before i conclude in infinity there are things that you cannot do in other tools you can have those progress bars you can have those um you can have your let's see if they have progress bars and references and uh, you know the ratings and the uh, all sorts of things that you can do they don't have it here but if you can also have your progress bar views and and you know references and and the you know different kind of attributes they probably have more than 10 or 12 attributes or you know, that you can create uh, different kind of columns different kind of fields different kind of data representation it's just incredible and by the way you can do task based collaboration and all it's all available in there okay i'm going to conclude now so if you have any questions queries you know just yeah drop me in, in comment if you want to criticize feel free i don't mind um but yeah you know this is something interesting i thought you should know all right bye for now